guys with PsychicFuture.com and this is your horoscope from the 20th to the 26th of August. So you'll be pleased to know that we have now finished Mercury retrograde, hooray! So all of the kind of um, chaotic mental energies that have been floating about are going to start to um, just fade out now. Like we will have a few days where it is still a little bit like that but that's called the shadow phase so we're now moving out of it, it's officially over so everything is going to start to settle once again. And hopefully you've learned some lessons from Mercury Retrograde about how to better organise yourself, um, how to adjust any things in your life that need adjusting. And actually, now we've got another shift that's going to help along with that, which is the movement into Virgo season. So the sun will be moving into Virgo um, towards the end of the week. And this is going to really help you to focus your mindset on what you need to get done. So anything that you've been wanting to start, anything you've been wanting to finish, that's going to actually um, start to come into fruition now. So you're going to be able to actually just focus in on doing the things that you've been wanting to do that maybe Mercury retrograde season kind of threw up in the air a little bit. And the best way to deal with this is to just really use this energy, stay focused, stay driven, stay dedicated and start doing some things that will like progress you towards what it is that you want in your life. So, as you can see, I'm indoors this week. I am still in Thailand, but it is the rainy season, so there are going to be some weeks when I cannot um, film outside for you guys. But I thought it would be nice if maybe I can um, pull a tarot card for you when I'm indoors, just to like jazz these readings up a little bit and give you a little bit extra. So, I've got some tarot cards here. This is the Thoth Tarot, um, and it is quite astrologically based as well, which is why I like it. So, let's see what card we can pick for you this week. Oh, this one wants to come out. Okay, we've got the Two of Swords, which is peace. I'm not sure if you can see that one. But basically, this is saying that now you need to have some mental clarity. You need to have, um, like, the opposites need to come together. So if you've been perhaps deciding um, on one thing or another in something, it might be absolutely any decision, but basically you've been facing some indecision recently um, and actually Virgo season will probably help with this because Virgo is very very good at analysing your options thinking about whether or not I should take one way or the other way and which is the best route for you so if you have been dealing with um, some indecision on like which path to take then hopefully this week you might get a little bit of clarity on that because Mercury retrograde is now over so we will get a little bit more clarity and Virgo season all about analysis, all about finding what works for you, finding the path that you want to take and just making sure that it is the right one for you. So keep that in mind and the name peace as well, that's nice. So whichever route you choose, whichever option you choose, just know that you're going to be all right and everything will unfold as it should do. So I hope you liked this reading. If you do, then check back next week and I hope you have a lovely week, Aries. Much love.